What's going on, everyone? Welcome to the Showcase channel. Uh, thanks for tuning in today. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, hope y'all's evening is going well. Um, I have here today a, a single box break. Um, I know some of you guys have watched some of my past videos, and I was referring to an SP Legendary Cuts. If a, a certain video got um, a certain number amount of likes, um, however, this is the box that I was not talking about. I, did, I actually had, do have a different box. This is a, uh, a recent purchase. Um, I picked this one up and uh, pretty excited to bust it. So I have never opened this product. Um, so we have a, a wow factor right here. Um, I guess if, uh, if you guys have opened this and have already seen it, already knows what comes out of it, um, congratulations. Um, I have not. Um, and if you were watching this for the first time, have not seen this product, then uh, kick back, relax, and uh, let's get the show started. You get, uh, this is 2009 SP Legendary Cuts, um, Upper Deck Baseball. You get four hits per box. So it's a pretty, pretty decent, uh, pretty good odds. I think there's only 12 packs. I'm pretty sure it's only 12 packs. Yeah, 12 packs per box. And they must be really thick packs, I don't know. It's usually from all the other SP Legendary Cuts, it's been only four, um, four cards per pack, so, but. And then if you carry to know the serial number, um, the last four are, uh, nine, four, two, five. On the logo, the logo there. So, okay, dokey. This is gonna be a good one. Okay, I guess let's just go straight from the top here. Alright, let's check out the designs of this thing. 2009 Baseball SP Legendary Cuts. Look for cut signatures of baseball with greats. So nothing on the odds on the back. Here we go. Let me see how many packs so far are in this. It doesn't even say... What does it say on the front? Oh, 12 packs. 5 cards a pack. Okay, so packs. Yeah, I was trying to decide of this. I have uh, some basketball stuff too that I recently got in some basketball boxes. So I was trying to decide if I want to do this or the basketball. So here we go Houston Astros. Um, well, it looks like the first uh, box is going to, or the first pack is going to have a hit in it. Um, Francisco Lindor. Uh, Genovi Soto. We've got uh, John Lester, Brian, and we've got the hit here. Let's go from the top down. Oh, here we go. I don't know what this is going to be. Let's just check it out. A duel. All right, this is nice. Uh, Cal Ripken Jr. and Miguel Tejada. 1990, 1990. So it looks like uh, the Orioles and Astros. Uh, short stops. Looks like uh, 1990 short stop and 2000s short stop. Uh, we got a bat relic in a jersey. So that's actually pretty sweet. Pretty nice card there. All right, I'll show all the hits um, at the end. All right, so I know this is probably going to be a little bit slow, but uh, I've never opened up this product, so if you guys are looking for a speedy break, um, yeah, I wouldn't recommend watching this one, so I'm going to enjoy this break. This is uh, personal, not for, it wasn't for sale, nobody bought it, so yeah, I know some people in the past have watched my videos and said that they're a little bit slow, but that's okay, because it's not your video, just saying that much. All right. Oh, 
we've got another hit here. Um, Trevor, Chipper Jones, and we've got, all right, wow. Jersey, 6 out of 25 of Ernie Banks. Wow, that's nice. Ernie Banks, 6 out of 25. Wow. This is actually my, sec my, uh, my uh, second uh, Ernie Banks relic. I think I have another uh, Ernie Banks relic um, from a different SP Legendary cut. So, uh, yeah, that is really nice. Um, jersey piece, 6 out of 25. Ernie Banks. All right, so back to back hits so far. So, and it looks like all the other cards are just base cards. So, 2009 Legendary Cuts is delivering. That's pretty good. I wouldn't think though that the boxes would be delivering one out of every pack so far. I just feel like that'd be kind of rare. Um, here's C other details. So this is a dud card. Oh wait, there is an insert back there. Okay, so we've got uh, Evan Longoria. Um, we've got Carlos Pena, Alex Rodriguez. Oh, there's an insert there. We've got a filler card, and we have wow, a uh, hockey card. Okay. <laughs> It's uh, the 20th anniversary cards of sports for the Red Wings, I believe. Detroit Red Wings. Turns three. So, I've got a co-worker who likes hockey, so maybe I'll give him this. But uh, this card here um, is 42 out of 550. Um, it is going to be uh, Dennis Boyd. Um, nickname the oil can. So, okay, first uh, two hits out of the way. Actually, pretty good so far, actually. So, the 6 out of 25 is probably the favorite one, but at least I've got some decent cards so far out of this. So, um, we've got Grady Sizemere. David Ortiz, Miguel Tejada, um, oh wow, there we go, check that out, let me see what this is, um, 59 of 550, Dwight Eisenhower, U.S. President, check that out, that's cool, Jordan leads to immortality, or Jordan leads bulls to immortality, wow, this is uh, sweet, I think these cards might be kind of rare, actually. I, I, everyone knows that I do basketball stuff like pretty regularly, and Jordan is my big PC. And I've never, I've, I, I want to say that I've seen this card, but I definitely have never pulled this card. So it's not probably too rare of an insert. But uh, the 20th anniversary stuff is pretty good. So I'm actually pretty excited about this card. Wow, that is a uh, pretty rare. Wow, Michael Jordan Bulls. So. Um, yeah, that was definitely, I think this was the last year that Upper Deck has definitely, uh, I'm going to consider that a hit so far, because that was, uh, 2009 was the last year that Upper Deck did, um, oh wow, it's a really thick card in there. This is a super thick card like it looks like, and I'm going to save this one, oh no it's not, I'm going to hold that one to the end, because that one looked huge, that one looked really, really thick. All right, let's see. This one is going to be a hit here. So we've got Ricky Inkel, Ichiro, uh, Mark Teixeira for the Yankees, um, Russell Martin, um, Nick. I don't know how to say that guy's last name. All right, and the hit is going to be Joe or uh, Jabba Chamberlain. Jabba Chamberlain um, jersey. Jabba Chamberlain jersey. Not too good there, but decent overall. Still a, and a cool looking Yankees um, jersey card there. So far, still the uh, the hit is probably the Ernie Banks out of 25. It's a pretty decent one there. 
So pretty good overall so far. Actually, pretty pretty satisfied with the with the purchase. Nothing too crazy. All right, we've got Curtis uh, Granderson, Alfonso Soriano. Got the filler card. We've got Cliff Lee. Um, we have San Diego Super Bowl and Nat McLaugh. Um, Denver Broncos. Oh, it says San Diego Super Bowl. I guess that would be uh, 17, 10, let's see. No, 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 32, I guess. Each, uh, I think each X Roman numeral is 10, I think. So that would be 32. All right. Should only be um, one hit left. If I come across the last hit in the next frequent packs, I will probably just hold it till the end. Um, of the video, so this pack doesn't have a hit in it looks like we got Cole Hamels. I think that might be a rookie there, too, so All of these cards are in really decent shape though We'll say that there's a filler card and we've got it looks like Wade Boggs Efforts from Wade Boggs. Yeah, Wade Boggs Tampa Bay Devil Rays Wade Boggs and the Cole Hamill it's going to be Major League. I don't know on the Cole Hamels. Send a comment down below or, uh, you know, post something that indicates if that's a rookie card or not. I think that's not Cole Hamels. He looks really young there, so I wasn't sure. I don't remember off the top of my head if what rookie year it is, so what his rookie year is. All right. No hit in this one, so we still have – should be one hit to go. Hopefully we get it. It's obviously too old of a product to uh, – the message uh, upper deck about so um, Prince Fielder Brian McCain we've got the filler card and we've got Johan Santana and we have world history um, FDR Memorial and we've got Scott Kaismere so all right let's see I think we're on our last two packs here oh no no Still got another bottom pack there underneath, so we keep the mojo going here. At first, the way that we started this off, I thought it might have been a, uh, I thought it might have been a hot box. Actually, to tell you the truth, it looked like it was going to be something cool. Um, the last hit is here, right here in this stack. So I'm going to go ahead and open up these last couple packs. These last packs should just be the regular regular um, cards here with the, just the inserts. I think we might get another one numbered out of 550, so Jacoby Ellsbury I think we got the last two packs here um, of course plus the, uh, the hit pack there but yeah, I was getting kind of uh, antsy because I was looking, hoping for a hot box. Um, I have had one of those um, before, or I have opened packs um, from a hot box before, and it was really crazy. So, Governor of Minnesota, I think that is a uh, wrestler, uh, Ventura, the professional wrestler, re wrestler, sorry. All right, last pack here, uh, empty box. Okay, last pack, and then we've got the last hit pack, and then that is that will that will end it all. Um, Jay Bruce, base card, Randy Johnson. That's a good one there. Um, oh wow, nice! Look at that. There's a uh, there's another Jordan card here. Chicago Bulls with its sixth title, um, securely the trophy case. 98 Finals board dynasty re resumes resume uh, was complete or resume was complete, capping the second three peat of the decade. Nice Jordan insert there. It's kind of technically just a Chicago Bulls, but still a nice one there. 
I'll consider that a hit from the box. So, all right. So we did deliver. So we did deliver four hits in the box. Um, I still think the six out of twenty-five Ernie Banks is a pretty nice one. So here we go. Last hit. Um, let's get these. Let's get these base cards here out of the way. We got two inserts numbered out of five fifty. Um, three other jerseys. And then this one is probably going to be in jerseys. It's actually for the Angels. Maybe it'd be Nolan Ryan, maybe. Oh, Vladimir Guerrero. Um, all right. So a single color patch. Congratulations. Outfielder Vladimir Guerrero. Okay. I'll do a quick recap really quick. So we got the Vlad single color jersey. Um, Non-serial numbered. We've got the Java Chamberlain single color jersey. Um, we've got the two Jordans. The two Jordans, I, I don't know how in the world these came out of there, but uh, two Jordan inserts here. Um, real nice. That's for the mess for the PC. Um, we've got the dual um, non numbered Cal Ripken Miguel Tejada. Nice one there. Bat Relic and Jersey Relic dual. And then we've got my favorite, probably of the break here, uh, six of twenty-five single color old school jersey here. You can tell by the color there of uh, legendary uh, Ernie Banks six of twenty-five single color jersey. So that was a nice, nice card there. Um, that'll do it. That was actually a pretty, pretty decent break. Pretty good overall. Um, if you like that one, if you want to see more of it, uh, comment down below. I'll try to pick some more up and. Uh, yeah, I guess thanks for tuning in. So it's uh, getting a little bit late. Got to put the baby to sleep. Um, anyways, yeah, the, that, that is it. If you guys see me, uh, yeah, other stuff out there you want to try to hit, uh, see me break or see videos of, I guess let me know and I'll, I'll see what I can do. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.